Might and Magic Heroes Online is a sad excuse for a tactical game. First, let me say that the game runs on the same engine like the Settlers 3 game. Settlers were decent, but this... Let's just say it's painfully boring. Like, really boring. You just follow tests and solve MMO-like quests. If we can even call them quests. While in Settlers that mechanic isn't that much of a problem. Because, you know, it's a town building game. But this is a strategy game. That doesn't work here. Also, there isn't much strategy here either. The only tactical thing to do is that you can gain bonus damage when attacking enemies from behind. Other than that, it's just who has the better team. The game is full of microtransactions because of that too. I'm not surprised. Also, for you to see how the game developers were lazy, I'll show you the game's character creation. This game is not even average. It's incredibly bad. The only good thing is the soundtrack, but since this is Mind and Magic, that should be normal. I'll give it a 2 out of 10. It's not that bad to get a 1, but it still has nothing to show, so I can't give it a 3. My advice, stay away, because this game has nothing to offer to anyone. I'm Cabron, and that was review for Might and Magic Heroes Online.